Hey guys, what's up? Eddie Alho here with KissAnalog.com. I've got this little toolbox here. I wanted to show you something. If you're ever trying to decide on a crimper, you know what I'm talking about? You need to crimp some large gauge wires. This goes down to 12 gauge, but it goes up to double watt. And you put these little jaws in here. And they're kind of magnetic. They kind of scope there. They're easy to swap out. There's a whole bunch of them here. I'll show you a quick video uh, of me using this thing. But this guy is... What? So guys, this is good for like eight tons. This handle just twists. It's really easy to use. Uh, it's got a little dot. Yeah, it's really simple to use. But this was super handy when I was putting together a solar system, uh, some cabling, and you want to get a really good connection. You don't need to solder. You don't want to solder. Uh, when you crimp the wire in, it crushes it so tight that it's gas tight. So it's a really good connection. And I mean, it's it's pretty fun to use. I was going to get one of those long handle ones, but then I got this little guy and, you know, it comes with gloves and it actually comes with this cutter, which was really handy. This is a nice sharp cutter. That's kind of scary looking. But anyway, uh, yeah, I just wanted to show you this. I'm going to show you a quick video just showing you the thing in operation. Okay, let's do it. All right, guys, we're using our clamp here, wire clamper, hydraulic. Put different chucks in it to get our big old lugs clamped on. So up here, I've got one clamped on, another one, put tape on it so we don't short them. And there we go. So there's our crimping tool. Here's our lugs. And there's the toolbox. The crimper has cutter. Very nice, very sharp. So we've got this prepped, the mounting lugs for the Redodo. So replacing the old one with the new one. We're gonna mount it here using these lugs for these big wires. And then we've got these wires to go to the Redodo. And we already crimped on those guys and this end. And I put three wires together to get the right gauge because didn't have any wire up here at the, at the cabin. So had to take a wire from the power supply that I have and use that, tripled it up and there we go. So there's our big lugs that we're gonna, we're gonna put one of these on and one of those on and then put this end up in the Redobo. All right, guys, that was me up in the mountains in Utah, uh, putting together some cables for a solar system. And this thing came in super handy. It did a really nice job. Looked nice and professional. So it was pretty neat. But yeah, I just wanted to show you this because I was just moving things around, kind of noticed it. And, and I remembered that I had a couple clips. So there you go, guys. Hey, use the links down below if you want to buy one of these. I think this thing was like... $48. It was on sale. Uh, it's probably on sale again. I I looked just recently and it was still on sale. But yeah, yeah, these old hydraulic guys, I mean, man, a lot of force. Instead of using those big, you know, uh, pliers that, you know, they're just larger. This is a nice kit. It has all the bits contained and cutter, everything. So, yeah. So, if you're doing this kind of work, 48 bucks, it's not too bad. Thanks for watching, guys. Just quick video.